Okay, so this video is going to show you the glue technique. So this is how you glue your lash extension. So there's a couple of options in terms of storage of your glue. So we've got the glue rings, which I think you should have in your packet. Um, or there's a jade stone. Um, for classic lashes, I like to use a glue ring. So that's what I'm going to use. So I've got a glue ring here. So you probably notice they're actually really tiny. They don't go on how you would wear a ring usually. They're too small. And it's because you're supposed to put it on the end of your finger. So I put it on the end of my index finger on the hand that I'm going to use for isolating. So I'm going to be isolating like this. And I need my ring here like that. So that's the setup. Keep my finger nice and straight. So put some glue in my ring. So when you open your glue, give it a good shake. Really good shake. More than what I've just done. You want the glue to go into your ring so that it's actually quite deep you want to be able to get the entire lash extension coated in glue so it doesn't need to be quite deep I've done that too much <laughs> okay so I've got my glue ring I've got my mannequin tidy up a little bit I've got my tweezers so we've gone through how to pick an eyelash up we just need to go through how to dunk it so I've separate one <laughs> can't get one now pick one up and where are we? So, yep, we've got the eyelash. We need to dunk it in the glue, pop it in slowly and pull it out slowly. And it gets a really even layer of glue without being too much. If you, uh, I think, I hope you can see, if you dunk it in too quickly, it gets beads, can you see? That is not what you want. They will dry as solid lumps and then your client will pick so you need to make sure that you don't have any beads on so you want to dunk it in the glue nice and slow and pull it out nice and slow so you've got a really thin layer of glue and it's you covered a large surface area of the lash so another thing when i see clients um sorry learners and they've got wonky eyelashes so that all the eyelashes are facing the wrong way and they've all fallen to the side it's because they've only dipped the root in so they've got a tiny little bit of glue so you need to you need to dip the lash in quite deep and it needs to be a thin layer okay i've just dipped the same lash into the glue multiple times you don't do that on a client you would only dip the lash in the glue once if you have to double dip get rid of that lash and start again so we'll just get rid of that one and i'll show you again on a fresh one so let's pick a lash up So you don't want lumps you want to make sure you've got enough glue without having any lumps and don't double dip your lash into the glue so now that that glue will dry in one second it dries really really quickly so don't glue your lash until you are ready to get it on we're going to be covering this in the next videos